So many really cool items found in the flea market run this morning, guys, and I filmed all of it. I'm gonna be showing you everything that I picked up in today's video. We're gonna be selling it for a profit on eBay. There is a second part of this video that I'm very excited to show you. And basically, I linked up with a viewer of the channel. His name is Danny, and he owns the business Gold Coast Pickers. And he's got a shed at these markets that he's only just opened up. It opened up yesterday. And I got to do a bit of a private tour in this video, and we even struck up a really sweet deal as well. So this was a really fun video to make. Hopefully you enjoy watching it. Let's get into the flea market and I'll show you what I picked up with the car boots. Um, would you do 10 for the two, so five a piece? Yeah. Yeah, thank you. And would you do, would you do $4 for those? Yeah. Sweet, yeah, thank you. Is the um the cabinet for sale here? It's 65. 65 yeah. on this. Yeah. And are there any shelving or is it a, is it a chest? Is it? Oh yeah. So it's almost like for your shoes or something, isn't it? Oh, what yeah. would you? I don't know, like I just had it in the lounge room and yep. with that, yeah, okay. I could do 60 for you. And what about the bedside? Oh, that's 35. 35 yeah. on that. Yeah. Not a, a pair, just, just one on its own? Um, yeah, just one on its own I had. Alright. Would you do, would you do 50? Yeah. I'll take, I'll take that for 50. You can have that for 30. Um, I might pass on that, but okay. I'll, I'll, I'll go okay. with that for 50, yeah. yeah. Don't, don't lose the key. Oh, Lock yes. Care. Thank you, you very much. Did you get the key? I do. I've got yeah, the key cool. here, yeah. Cool, cool. Thank you very much. Okay. I actually really love this. It just looked really unique and interesting and the carvings as well on it. That should go okay. I'm not sure exactly what I think I'll get, but to get it for 50 bucks, pretty good. So which are our good ones? This pile down here. This pile. Oh. So... Shrek 2, Scooby Doo, I think that's 15, yep. Cars is 15, and then Over the Hedge was 15. Uh, yeah, around that. They're all in good nick too. Yeah, and then Monopoly Party wasn't. Nah, no, I don't that. They're all the duds. They're all the duds. Put them. So they're all no that good. That surprised me, Charlie. Charlie, I thought we, yeah. Yeah. Not great. That these we're going to work on. We found four. Mm -hmm. Would you do 20? That's 20. Oh, that is 20. Yes, it is 20. Firm on 20? Yeah. Yeah, okay. That's time I am. Yeah, that's fair. I'm trying to be, you know, be fair, but. Oh, no, no, no. I appreciate everything. I'm not making any money at the moment, so you just sort of, you know what I mean? Yeah. You're making the money. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, all right. Well, what do, you, what do you want to do on 20? Um, yeah. How can we do it? Yeah. We'll add that in. <laughs> Yeah, we'll put that over there. So 20 so far. <laughs> what size? Is that a women's, is it? One's, one's mine, so one's a women's one and one's a men's one. Okay. Yes. Bottle O Racing Team. Yep. Size 12. This oh, you got two. Yep, this is the men's one. That's the men's. The men's one. That's a small actually. That's a small men's. It's nice, though. Yeah, they are nice stuff. I only like nice stuff. You can, yeah, and then... This is, and this is the women's... This is mine. That's yours. Yeah, Ford Performance Racing. That's a size small, too, is it? Yep. Well, why don't... And you said 15? Yeah. What if I do 15 for that men's one in the middle there? Which one is that one? It's that one there. That's about it. Yeah. Mm, that's a bit iffy now, that's hubby's. No. <laughs> I know. Actually, because it's his one, I will hang out for 20, because his is better than mine. You know what I mean? You can tell. Mine's more all that. Sure. His is the proper one. So I'll, um, have all those ones I'll give you 20. So we've got 40 all up with those games, hey? Yeah. All right. The, um, the gun there, how much on that? Oh, so I asked yeah, the race, but it's $20. Dollars. You got 20 on that? Yeah, we said I don't so much race what I can get for them. Yeah. Um, so I don't know if you can get my own personal. Yeah, do you know if it, you, would, you wouldn't know if it works or anything? Because 
I don't know how to plug them into the television. They're not on heaven on the television anymore. See? Yeah, that's right. Because these need a... Um, memory cards. Didn't get them. How much would you do on the memory cards? Just because I was good at spare ones. Ten bucks for four. That's not too bad. I don't even know what they're going to call it. That's handy, handy just to have those. Yeah, I'll leave the, I'll leave the gun. I'm not sure. All right, so we'll take the games and the jacket. That's 40. So that's 40. And you owe me 10. There you go. Thank you very much. Appreciate that. Oh, no. I think it's going to set in. Oh, no. That's awful. It's the last thing you want to see. Jamie, what do we do? What do we do? I don't know if that's going to stop. I reckon that's setting in. That sucks, doesn't it? In all our time at the flea, we've never had a Sunday where it's rained like this. I wouldn't mind going and checking out Gold Coast Pickers shop. See if you'll open up early for us. It's a good, I'll tell you what, off the markets, it's a great location. Did you, um, did you have to do some work to try and get this spot? No, it was vacant. Um, it was previously a camping shop, I believe, and before that, a, uh, a telephone shop. Yeah, right. Have you thought, yeah, this is, this is actually big, isn't it? It's an awesome space. And how long have you been working away on it? Yeah. Four weeks ago. Yep. So all of this is what we've found up here from garage sales since we've been in. So. And gum tree apps. All of this? Everything. All your stock? Everything we've bought since we've been in. So nothing has come from anywhere else? I bought about four 25 kilo boxes of stuff from Adelaide. Yeah. So literally enough to fill one with Wow, dude. Well, you've, um, you've done really well. It's insane. What's your specialty? What do you like to... Uh, whatever makes me the most amount of money. <laughs> oh, I hear ya. Oh, you got the oh, look at these jerseys. Oh, yeah. Look at these jerseys. Sport clothing too. Oh, the Brisbane Lions. That's rad. Look at that. Some awesome stuff, man. Yeah, it's just like the draw, you know how it is. You, um, you might get 20 sales and only one might be good. But that keeps you going to the next one. Bro, you've got some serious stuff. There's a few things. So if we come around here, we'll do this. We'll do this. Yeah. Alright, so, for instance, I'll take this and this for consignment. <laughs> Um, so it's going to be 50-50 basically, so we're going to be doing whatever it sells for, minus the fees, minus the, um, the postage costs, and then we'll split the profits. Minus the purchasing costs. Minus the purchasing costs. <laughs> well, no, no, not minus the purchasing costs. Um, so we'll go with those three, but we're also going to do your cool with the three charts. So let's go and have a look at those. Danny's got a YouTube channel, and the YouTube channel is Gold Coast Picker. Is that? Yeah, mate. I'll, uh, I'll put it here for you guys to, uh, to go and check out. Give him a subscribe, because have a look at his store. He's got so much cool stuff. And uh, we're, gonna, um, we're gonna start off by selling a few things for him on eBay, because you don't sell on eBay, do you? No. No, so that's where I can definitely help out. And we're gonna, we're gonna look at these. We've got these street sharks here. Thanks, mate. Um, I don't even know if this is a straight shot. Yeah, it is. It is? Yeah. I had a letter in this morning saying that's one that he's actually never had before. He's had a couple of the cool ones. Look at that. He's never had that one. That's insane. And these are, these will sell really quick on eBay. The, the store, it might sit for a little bit. Yep. Um, but you'll get, you'll get great money quick. Just count 
don't have any of there. Yeah. So, I mean, um, however you want to do it, um, we'll keep in touch. I'll probably see you every Sunday at the market. You'll see me at moving forward yeah. anyway. Um, and I'll, what I'll do is I'll do an Excel spreadsheet. I'll itemize them all up and I'll, I'll list up what they've, what they've been listed for. And then I'll just keep off. I'll get on the fan of channel, I'll, I'll keep in touch. I'll, I'll, oh, watch, yeah. I'll watch your updates. <laughs> but from, a, from a number set. Yeah, yeah. From a number set. Um, we'll do it off that. And then I'll show you the split. That's what I've done in the past. Oh, easy. So there you go. I think the best part about what we do is the fact that you can connect with people in the community that do the exact same thing and just share your stories and experiences. And Danny's obviously got a wealth of knowledge. He's, he's done this for quite a while, certainly a whole lot longer than I have. But I guess on the eBay side of things, I can really help him out and, and make him a few extra dollars as well, rather than having those items just sit on the shelf for quite some time. So all of those street sharks, they are going to sell for massive money. Street sharks are a big money mover, and they're also a really quick sell through rate on eBay. So hopefully a few dollars for me and hopefully a few uh, dollars for Danny, obviously, as well. Hey, my 30% club is that stick around to the end of the video. I wanted to show you this haul here. I was able to pick up a PS2 in the uh, in the car boot sale today. I didn't get any footage of it. It was actually with the lady that I bought the, um, the Bottle O racing jumper and a couple of the games that I split with Jamie. Um, well, I also bought this off her as well for $60. She had it for 80, I got it for 60. So there's a few games in here. I think there's about seven games, two controllers, all the cables. There's another Shrek 2 in there. So I've actually got two Shrek 2s to sell, but um, for 60 bucks, something like that should go on to sell for about $160 on eBay. So I should be able to make about, I don't know, maybe 50, $60 in profit after fees and post. So when you consider everything that we bought today, the relationships that we're building, which I think is the most important thing when it comes to your reselling, build the relationships with the people in your community or even around the country as well because it's amazing what you can do when you are when you work together so hopefully you've enjoyed the video guys let me know in the comments below what have you found in the flea in the garage sale out in the op shops today i would love to hear it over the course of the last week and um, yeah put that into the comments below appreciate your support the 30 percent clubbers that are still here at the end of the videos you guys are the absolute best guys appreciate being here we'll see you soon